every second order tensor can be expressed as the sum of symmetric and antisymmetric tensor. Let Aij be the components of a symmetric covariant tensor of rank 2 in XI system. Therefore, Aij can be written as half of Aij plus half of Aji plus half of Aij minus half of Aji. In the next line, Aij can be written as half of Aij plus Aji plus half of Aij minus Aji, which implies Aij is equal to Bij plus Cij, where Bij is equal to half of Aij plus Aji and Cij is equal to half of Aij minus Aji. Interchanging i and j in equation 1, we get bji equal to half of aji plus aij. In the next step, we can write half of aij plus aji because aij is symmetric, so which is equal to bij. Therefore, bij is symmetric. Interchanging i and j in equation 2, we get cji equal to half of aji minus aij is equal to, we can take minus common, so it will be minus half of aij minus aji, again which is equal to minus cij, therefore cij is anti-symmetric tensor. Thus, from a start, it is seen that the second order tensor Aij is the sum of symmetric tensor Bij and anti-symmetric tensor Cij. Hence, every second order tensor covariant or contravariant can be expressed as the sum of symmetric and anti-symmetric tensor.